Hello everybody, how you doing? Welcome to my channel, my name is Bobby. This video is going to be very simple, it's going to be about marijuana. Oh yeah, I've done two previous ones. I don't speak much about it because it's a personal matter, it's a personal choice and issue. I, but I also think that it's, it's misunderstood in so many ways because it's over abused, it's not processed right, it's not, you know, it's just been taboo from get go, so how the hell are you supposed to make that mainstream? We got people in Congress doing cocaine, but you feel uncomfortable about marijuana. These people are assholes, by the way. <laughs> and marijuana is a miracle drug, it's basically a natural thing you can grow in your backyard. You can use it as ointments. You don't even need to smoke it. You can use it for rope. I mean, literally, the possibilities are endless with this damn plant. And the fact that it should have been put up in there. You probably make fuel out of it. I don't know. Buildings. I mean, think about it. Just growing something and continually growing something. And you can have product from it. You know. It should have been done a long time ago. But there's a lot of rich people who probably would lose a lot of money. If that were to happen unless they're in on it and they're in charge of it right <clears throat> I only talk about this because my, my injuries and my past pain and you know and it does it makes a difference and the, the thing I wanted to bring up the most part is not only the pain the inflammation and the pain that it heals but the but the mood but the your vibration your happiness Happiness is a good thing, right? We can all agree that being happy is good. Okay, now that we're all on the same page about happiness, laughter, also good. <clears throat> and you ever notice how when you see, when they per, per, portray like people smoking weed in, in, the sh in the movies and stuff and they're always really happy, they're always happy laughing. And it, I mean, sometimes it gets a little ridiculous and over the top, but like I said, they have some really good weed. So yeah, a little moderation. We could always talk about moderation, but the fact is, these people are happy. How dare they be happy? This thing ha that makes you happy. I know people that are taking prescription medications to make them fucking happy. Xanax. But what the fuck is that? Ambien or not? I think that's for, supposed to be for sleep, right? I don't know. But you know what I'm talking about? All these, all these prescription chemicals that they'll give you so to put you in a good mood and all you need to do is smoke a joint and you don't have any side effects your can your kidneys won't fail you know what I mean like I said when I used to take pain pills for years when I was first injured and I went and I went by their rules and their procedures and their doctors and I took all their pills and bullshit oh my god I had to take and I had, had to go twice a year to basically get my kidneys tested to make sure I wasn't being killed. You beautiful little birds. But yeah, yeah. So obviously, I, I have some you know experience when it comes to not only pain and management, but also marijuana. I've been smoking it since I was a kid. I was surrounded by it. I'm from California, right? My dad smoked it when he was a kid. All his cousins and brothers smoked it. My brother smoked it. My sister smoked it. I smoked it. My mom smoked it. Everybody we knew smoked it. This California, <clears throat> and I and I I grew up with it, pr preferring it over alcohol. I used to, you know, I could drink, whatever, but I just preferred weed. I, and it was a funny thing it was whenever I get really hung over, weed is the thing that would make me feel better. I got hung over off of Jose Cuervo once. It was just terrible. Don't drink that shit. Hundred percent agave if you're gonna have to do that crap anyway. But I got so, I mean, I was just like, oh, it was terrible. It was the worst hangover ever. And my sister went and got me some weed. And within a half hour of smoking this weed, I went from being on the couch, migraine, just nauseated, just feeling like absolute shit. You know what I'm talking about if you've ever been hungover. To half an hour later laughing, sitting up, done. Is it a hangover cure? Hell yes. I don't think they advertise that enough either. Like I said, it doesn't get out because alcohol would take a serious hit. Oh, by the way, I just want to throw out something quick about the Oscars. Second worst ratings ever. 
I think if Will hadn't a slap motherfucker, they, we wouldn't even have known it even happened. How sad is that shit, right? And that used to be something very prestigious, but obviously they're just a bunch of, they've realized that people are just turned off by their bunch of just, you know, elite fucking douche, rich douchebags that are just obviously out of touch with reality. Sad. Anyway, enough about that crap. But yeah, <laughs> just like throw that out there real quick. But yeah, marijuana is the truth. It is. I think in moderation. And it's weird because I, when I use it, oddly enough, as in the shaman aspect of it, I, when I use it and it puts me in like a trance and I can focus and it, and it yeah, it, hey, it works for me. I am I can do whatever the fuck I want. I'm retired. I'm 51. You can kiss my ass, right? I don't drink all day and I try not to smoke all day, especially if I'm not driving. If I get up in the morning and I have to be behind that wheel, I don't touch that shit. It's just the way it is. I wouldn't take any pain pills before I drive either. It just doesn't something you don't do. You don't drive intoxicated with anything, period. Ever. End of story. And then when you drive and you're parked and you're not going anywhere, you can do what you want, right? It's your freedom. I'm very all about freedom, baby. So like I said, with this little seed, little marijuana seed, you can basically make ointments, you can make edibles, you can smoke it, you can make rope out of it, you can make clothing, you can make building material. So yeah, the miracles of medical marijuana, or just marijuana or cannabis, let's just go there. The miracles of cannabis. Anyway, that's it. That's this video. I want you to have a wonderful day. I love you, God loves you, and the universe digs cannabis. They made it, baby. Love you, bye.